Hey, what's up, guys? I'm Praetorian. And Jinx here. And welcome back to Desperados 3 on the PlayStation 4 Pro. Alright, guys, so let's go and get started. Remember, we're supposed to be going over here to get the dress from her. Uh, and it has been a long time since we played, so do forgive so, about Frank. if I have a lot of mistakes, guys. And of course, we just started the recording, so you know there's going to be a lot of vehicles going by. I don't really know the fucker. Until we escape. I'll take that. Then what else? All right, so we can get through the bushes here, and then we're gonna have to like sprint over to that bush there. Although I don't know if he can see over there. He can see over there. Mm-hmm. Okay, so you got a squat. So essentially, we're gonna have to use the coin to get him to look over there. All right, got it. Uh, so let's make sure we got the coin selected. Throw it on over here and uh, distract this guy. I don't remember how to do anything, guys. <laughs> All right, so he's looking. Go, go, go. Just pennies. Every penny counts, Mr. Cooper. Not if they're fake. All right, so we are past there. There's another person over here. Well, does the say anything about it? I don't think so. so. Yeah, we can take out the poncho guy. In order to take out this gunman here, which you don't necessarily have to do, you could just sneak into this area here. Uh, but yeah, we're going to have to bring both of them if we're going to do the sneaking rather than taking them out. What if you just knifed that guy in the face and he fell down? Who? That one. We've already done that before, Jinx. Did we? It alerts this guy. Well, I mean, technically the dead guy would be crouching, so would he be <laughs> able to be seen? <laughs> We've already done this many times, Jinx. Yes, he would be able to be seen. That's just my answer to everything. Just what throw if a you knife at him. him in the face? Just knife him. I think so that what, might work. What we need to do is switch over to the next character. Uh, but yeah, we've been playing a lot of Last of Us. Again, I spent all day, for the day that we celebrated Father's Day, spent that whole day just playing the Last of Us. And uh, had a good time. Let's see, can these guys see? Okay, so we could actually squat up right next to them without any problem here. And so what we need to do is set them, set her to I've knock them out, and then we'd set him to kill that guy. She's gonna kick him in the shin. All right, so we're gonna go on over here and then execute. But he doesn't get killed, so that does result in us having to like come over here. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure which would hurt more. And either pick him up and throw him off the... Let's tuck you in. Or I guess we could just hog tie him and leave him there. He won't be able to get free. Won't he call for help, though? I don't know. So let's just throw his ass over anyways. Because yeah, I'd be worried that he'd be like, Hey, you. <laughs> He's not alive anymore, guys. All right, so let's go ahead and get this guy. We'll do the same, just so we don't have to worry about their bodies being seen. Or we could just put them in the bushes, I suppose. Not everybody's got to get thrown off the cliff. Yeah. So I guess we'll kill the poncho guy. Uh, so not because we really need to, but because it seems like he's harassing these poor young ladies. Yeah. I'll ask again. Did any of you see her? Well, I think the civilians will report you killing somebody, though. I don't think you can just kill somebody with impunity. <laughs> I could be wrong on that, though. Uh, let's go I ahead and know. do... Maybe if you were the lady and you went over there and kicked him, then the ladies wouldn't care. Yeah, maybe. I suppose there's a chance, but I, I don't think so. Do but we'll, we just saved it, so what we'll do is we'll try it out. Let's go and bring her over here. She's like, excuse me. Yeah, you can't do it. <laughs> so yeah, they do. They do alert. <laughs> Uh, so... Whatever happened to loyalty? That means we're just gonna avoid the poncho guy completely and instead go over this way where we will have to deal with a couple dudes, I think, that are in here. So we can steal this. We actually have two dudes. And I think there's a third one over here. Yes, sir. He's over there hanging his wang off the rocks. Mm -hmm. Just taking a piss. Fuck. Alright, so we'll squat down so they can't see us here. Whoop. And then we'll know, take. Moved around. Yeah, and then we'll take this guy out. Now, I don't know if they can see us at all. Yeah, it looks like they will be able to see us. 
if we attempt yeah he's glancing so basically we have to kill this guy when he goes around the corner here so we'll kill him and then we'll have to eliminate these other two which again are going to be kind of tricky because they're looking at each other Man, their necks got to be tired. All that looking around? Mm -hmm. Keeping that head on a swivel like that? Like, I mean, they must be paid well. <sighs> they're goons. You know they're not paid well. I didn't know he could see us here. He's got All right. Guys. Yeah, I didn't know that he could see us over there. I thought that this area here was blocking it. That's what I thought. It clearly is not, though. Uh, but yeah, we've been enjoying The Last of Us. James has been watching me play. Because she didn't want to play herself because she's scared. Well, we couldn't time out <laughs> how we would both play simultaneously without ruining the story for one or the other. Well, then there's also the fact that when we were first looking at the game, Jinx was like, nope, mm-mm, yeah, nope. nope. Like, The Last of Us was, like, is You were barely able to make through it. Yeah. Ever, but, yeah. It was very stressful for me. Because <laughs> Jinx was terrified. So, essentially, I think we need to kill him when these two are talking. Uh, also, something we haven't used yet is there's a fast forward in this mode. So we're fast forwarding right now. Are we? Yeah. Oh. See him walking oh, faster? Okay. So you're just like, move along. Mm uh hmm. -huh. And so you get them when they're talking there. And when they're doing that, I think we can kill this guy without them seeing that. There we go. Your poop? And just like oh, that. He didn't fall very far. No. <laughs> well, he disappeared, though, so that's what matters. Uh, let's save this thing. Quick save. I'm sure a critter carried him off. Mm -hmm. All right, so essentially we can kill the guy sitting down while the other guy is walking away. Got it. We'll just hide in the bush there. Yeah, we'll just hide in the bush until, until it's time. And then knife him in the face. <laughs> and then knife him in the face. We'll probably chuck our knife, actually. Actually, let's go ahead and do that and get ready for that. What that woman scream? Not if she's looking the other way. Oh, okay. So we got a... Hunt Showdown got a new patch. So basically, we have to take this guy out and get his body placed somewhere before the other guy turns back around. Interesting. All right, so we'll chuck the knife. Oh, okay, yeah, so that is that. the okay. The, that's what I was thinking. That was I wasn't sure mm -hmm. though. Yeah, it does seem that that uh, little circle is how far they can hear the sound. So we have to essentially, well, hmm, because I think no matter what, the lady's gonna see that, isn't she? She might, because yeah, I think she's within the circle. Yeah, so that could cause a problem here. Uh, I'm not entirely sure how to deal with that then. Oh well, we wouldn't be able to. We just wouldn't be able to do the knife attack because then she. Don't want to do that. I got lots of these. Well, she can be just. Oh, no, no, never mind. No, there's no way for us yeah. to chuck the knife. We'll have to go walk up and stab him. Well, that's unfortunate because I like chucking the knife. So yeah, we'll go ahead and fast forward through these guys. Uh, but yeah, I'm I'm really liking it so far. I know that there's been some negative reviews. Apparently, For whatever reason. <laughs> not entirely sure why some people don't like the story or whatever. Let's hurry up, hurry, hurry, hurry. Hey, oh, oh, I'm no. stuck. Fuck. Ah. Oh, oh god damn it. <laughs> <laughs> well, that We're in sucks. the bush. You can't get us. Yeah, the problem here is that, uh... Well, it also doesn't help me get caught on the environment, but, uh... I guess you could have the, the girl, like, in another bush waiting to kill the guy once he turns around. Yeah, you could take them both out. It's it's not really entirely necessary to do so, but yeah, we could could do that, I suppose. Wait, that nice? But we could have been able to do this if, if I didn't get caught on the environment. Mm -hmm. That's that's what actually ended up happening here, is that we got caught on the environment. But yeah, it'll actually be really hard to time that, in fact, oh, to true. have them both run at that. Yeah, you wouldn't be able to do that. It'd be incredibly difficult to time that, uh, because you have to do it... Yeah, I think that'd be too hard. What we just need to do is get over here as soon as possible. Be quicker. Yeah, and not get cut again. Not get cut on the environment. One less to worry about. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. And there we go. Nice. So yes, it can be done. I'm all ears. It's got to be smart with it. Now the problem here is, of course, that she can only knock him out. And can't she even drag him? I don't know. Can she hog tie him at all? No, she can't do any of that. Okay, so she can drag him a little bit. Yeah. God, she sucks at it, though. Yeah, she's not not very strong, apparently. 
why you gotta work on your mashal. Mm hmm. I have a feeling like that woman's gonna see us putting him into the bush. Nah. <laughs> She's worried about her flowers. Alright, so let's go ahead and get this body hid and then we'll quick save. Alright, so let's go ahead and quick save this. Although, that's right, he's not going to uh, stay knocked out. Oh. <laughs> oh, she heard that. She's like, what the hell? <laughs> Alright, so we need to switch over to this guy. That's exactly what she just did, Jinx. Alright, so let's kill this guy. So brutal. So we don't have to worry about him anymore waking up. And then... I'm not entirely sure what to do about her. We just gotta take her clothes. There's another person over there. I didn't even see him. Oh. He might not even look over this way. Yeah. <laughs> he doesn't seem to care what the hell we're doing. He's looking at that man's booty. Mm-hmm. He likes what it looks when he bends over. Oh, Alright, well, let's tie her up. You got it. And then we don't have to worry about her waking up. <laughs> you punch her in the back of the head? <laughs> Donkey punched her. Alright, so we don't want to kill her because she's just a innocent woman. Is she? She's up there arranging flowers and shit like a head oh, villainess. <laughs> Is that what villains do? Yeah, jinx? they just worry about their flowers. Alright, so once Kate is picked up a disguise, she can put it on by selecting the skill wheel and pressing square. While disguised, she can traverse enemy territory almost undetected. Long coats and dogs will see through the disguise, so that's something to consider. Okay. Dogs can smell a hussy from a mile away. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so let's just see. Let's get on with it. All right, so that's her disguise right there, and then of course we have the perfume vial as well uh, that we can make use Briefly of. Briefly blinding men with passion. Mm -hmm. All right, so let's go ahead and get these two selected, and then start making our way. Well, I guess we should take a look and see how we need to get over there. Are men affected by perfume? Like in the way that women are affected by a really good cologne. W what way are women affected by a really good like, cologne? Like, damn, that dude smells good. <laughs> well, I mean, I, I think they probably say that. Like, damn, that woman smells nice. Smells like sweet apricots or some shit like that. Uh, but I don't know if... Uh, well, I guess how like affected can women get by Well, I guess I don't know either. <laughs> I'll just ask what it is. Oh, shit. <laughs> Well, that was stupid. Yeah, it doesn't look like you're wearing your outfit. Wow. She's not. She just tried to get up here on the roof. And so she went around because she can't climb the vines. Oh, she took off? Yeah, she just took <laughs> off on her own. I didn't tell her to do that I'm shit. Like, what is she doing? She just did her own damn thing, man. I hope we quick saved it. Probably not. I think we did. Yeah, we quick saved. Okay. All right, so good to know that she will move to follow. We did have her set to follow us. And so I guess that was my fault. Uh, but I didn't expect her to run off into them or whatever. Uh, but yeah, I, I don't know, man. Like, I recognize when a woman smells nice. What the? Come on, whoa. Oh, God damn it. This game, man. <laughs> it's like so, like, challenging. It's really all about, again, it's like a puzzle is what I have found. Uh, that it's like just solving a puzzle. I'm not really a big you fail and fan then you of puzzles figure personally. Figure out a way to not fail. Yeah. Until yep. you fail again. Mhm. Mm and then you just continue to fail. <laughs> just like... All right. So, what we have to do is get her through with the skies. And I don't know how far these the guys go. The are coming. Okay, they don't go all the way over here. So we'll have to get her through just with the skies, and then him through a different way. What the fuck is going on there? It looks like they're about to have a shootout, doesn't it? Doesn't it look like yeah. they're about to have a shootout? What's going on here? <laughs> that guy does not like that one over there. Yeah, this guy right here has got his back turned. It's a feud between the red pants and the blue pants. No, nah, this is about a lady, Jinx. Yeah, because the lady liked the blue pants better. No, the red she pants. liked the red pants guy. Yeah, she thought it meant passion. Passion in his pants. And, <laughs> and he ain't afraid and, to show it. And he ain't afraid to show it. Oh, so here he goes again. He fucked this guy who doesn't even have blue pants. He's got like oh, a blue shirt. He's got gotcha. a blue shirt. Yeah, he, so red pants fucked blue shirt's girl. And uh, now they got a feud going. How dare he? Mm hmm. That's what I'm saying. All right, so let's go ahead and get through with her first since she's easiest. Show goes on. We just need to change up your gear. 
I don't know what the long coats are and if there are any through here. Uh, is this a long coat? He's a poncho. Yeah, that's a poncho, man. What do the long coats what look the like? What a long coat? We've seen them before. I, I just don't they remember. Got long coats on, right? I think that might have been the guy we took out that was right here. I think he was a long coat. Either that or a poncho. Is there, the real question is, that there are there any long coats we need to worry about? Yeah, I don't see any. Oh, we got to push that on somebody's head. Yeah. We'll do that as the other guy, though. Because uh, her, we're just going to have her sneak through here. Uh, have her use her ability. And how does it work? She's changing, I think. No, she's not. There you go. You got to hit what L2. Do you think? You look like a wolf in maid's clothing. You think it's enough to fool him? Only one way to find out. Now, what's this about? Flirt. Kate can flirt with guards to distract him. Flirting with the guard will make them turn in Kate's direction as long as she wishes. Okay, so we could actually keep her here. Halfway out of here. In, in order to distract anybody. Company's gonna attack He's in the way. Yeah. yeah. I gotta get word to him. So for right now, we'll just put her out here and then. We'll use this guy and see how far we can get and see if we need Kate's flirtation to get out of here. Probably not, since we've already gone through this area once before, but I don't know. We'll see. Uh, can anybody see this guy here? Yes. Mr. Poncho. Mm -hmm. Yep. All right, so we want to place the marker here just to see who can see it and when they can see it. Yeah. It's going to be kind of tricky getting rid of this guy. We'll have to flirt with that dude, I think. Go flirt to... with the poncho, man. Mm -hmm. In order to get him taken out. All right, so let's go ahead and do some flirting here. We'll wait until they start to move the other way. Like, excuse me, mister. All right. So we should now be able to kill this guy without him seeing shit. And then just throw him into the bush below. Turn on. And hopefully she keep that game up for a while. Oh, oh damn it. no. I was thinking we better get both of them. Yeah. We fucked that up. Said as long as she wants, so. Yeah, she still got him distracted. <laughs> <laughs> Who he rude. How did this happen? All right, so let's go ahead and save it. Because I think we just got through here. So the question is, can he get through here without setting all these guys off? No. <laughs> when was the last time we saved? We just saved. Okay. So we're probably going to have to wait until the alarm goes off before we're able to continue by. But I think there will be what, one person that's going to cause us some issues here. We might have to flirt with them. She can't flirt with groups? <laughs> no. Apparently that just doesn't work. She's like, I'll give you guys a group discount. <laughs> it ain't even like that. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so yeah, it's going to be tricky. We'll have to flirt with that guy at the very least. Again, though, these guys are all still on alert, so it's kind of causing some trouble. He'll flirt, he'll flirt with her again. Sure, he will. He told her to stuff a cork in it. <laughs> <laughs> How is he able to see when they're flirting? Well... It only like distracts them. It only keeps them looking in one way, mm -hmm. right? So hmm. I guess we'd have to look. We have to change the way. yeah. We'd have to change the direction that she's facing. So we'll have them distract them this way. I got what you need, <laughs> baby. Uh, but anyway, yeah, we are now currently about oh maybe nineteen twenty hours into the Last of Us, and again, I'm I'm really enjoying it so far. Uh, the combat's super fun, uh, but I will say that I don't think that it's better than the first one. Oh, no. Well, you say it like it was a for sure thing that it wouldn't have been better. I think they could have made. Uncharted 4, for instance, is... What is going on? I thought they were seeing her for a second. Uh, Uncharted 4, uh, for instance, is, is absolutely uh -huh. fantastic. God damn it. There's too many guys down here. Yeah. I didn't realize there's so many down there. Uh, Uncharted 4 is one of my favorite of the Uncharted games. Uh, Uncharted 2 might be the best one, in my opinion. Yeah, I think Uncharted 2 is probably the best one. Uh, but Uncharted 4 is fantastic. And so it's not like Naughty Dog hasn't proven that they can do a better sequel. 
I mean, for Christ's sakes, Uncharted 1 is the worst of the series, in my opinion. Uh, so yeah, I don't think that it was a foregone conclusion that Last of Us 2 couldn't have been better. I don't know, I just don't see how you top the story of the first one. Again, I feel like they could have. They just didn't. Uh, again, the first one was so great, though, man. It was a fantastic game. Uh, but yeah, this I think it's good. Um, the, the action's super fun. I don't know what everybody's talking about the story yet. Everybody's really hating on the story so far. And I'm just not... Uh, and we're not going to spoil anything. Yeah, we're not going to spoil anything, guys. And the game just came out, so we're not going to talk about the actual story or, or what goes on on it. Uh, but yeah, just saying that's, that I don't really understand the... The hate? Yeah. Yep. We need to really do some autosaves here. We're getting sick of doing the same stuff. And maybe when we move out this bush this time, we'll we'll go back out. But yeah, it's it's this is kind of challenging. Yeah, a bit. I'm not entirely sure how we're gonna get past this. Cause I don't think we can go. Yeah, we can't go back there. Those guys weren't there the first time. Can we go into this bush and then drop down? Yeah, maybe. And then we'd only have to distract that gunman. Okay, that's what we'll do. Though that's gonna be quite challenging as well. Yeah, I don't see how you're well. gonna get through there. Well, we got to. We can do it, Jinx. When this guy leaves, Maybe. yeah, we can squat over to this bush right here. Oh, but now that this guy keeps running, <laughs> he needs to figure out where he wants to be at and he get there. He doesn't know. He's confused. He's probably the youngest of the oh. bunch. Oh lord! <laughs> There's just so many people you have to consider. Like, why do the bad guys have so many henchmen? ridiculous what i can say is that if if we weren't playing this for the channel i probably wouldn't play this game no I i've never really been <laughs> yeah i've never really been one to play games uh where you have to like redo uh stuff over and over again i've never been one to really enjoy that style of gameplay mm -hmm. uh you know i just have I have just such limited time uh, for gaming, and I don't often want to like do the same level over and over and over again. And I think that's probably why I don't play stealth games that much anymore. Yeah, I've always hated stealth games. I just suck at them. I'm just a run and gun kind of person. I'll try to sneak, but then I get caught, and I want to at least be able to get out mm -hmm. of there and not like, oh, well, you got to start over because you weren't sneaky enough. <laughs> I'm like, just let me shoot everyone and be done with it. All right, so what we need to do is distract the guy that's looking off that way so that we can get get behind him. Oh, she can distract one oh, one. Oh, shit, okay. Okay, so she can do group deals. Group deals. <laughs> <laughs> she can distract that feller. Nope. Oh, he's up on a high part. All right, so we're gonna have to come do this again. I hope we don't have to take him out. But yeah, it's getting really difficult to get Cooper through this area. Hmm. So basically, we need to we need to figure out how to do this. So there's really no way for her to take him out. No, not really. And he can see us no matter what we do, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Can anyone see him, though? Well, how would you take him out, though? Kick him in the nuts. Yeah, but that only knocks him out for such a short amount of time. And so then you got that timer going before you're about to set off the, you know, the alert. You gotta hurry. You gotta kick him in the nuts and then go flirt. <laughs> I just don't know that because, we, because we're uh, basing off of this guy leaving. Like, he has to leave for that yeah. split second there. And so well, because Cooper we're... we could just put on a fucking dress. Then I know. be sneaking around together. Exactly. Uh, so we wait for them to talk. Knock him out, then run over and distract. I mean, this is, yeah, this is going to be really difficult. Oh, there's still somebody seeing this. That crew. Oh, and that guy right there. <laughs> Everyone. Good God, guys. I'm going to tell you what, man. This is, <laughs> this is like ridiculously challenging. Uh, yeah, and, and, and the problem here is that Cooper can't really do much. You yeah. know what I mean? Like, I suppose he could throw the coin to distract those two. Yeah, then you have the, you still got this guy. There's no way to avoid that guy. We didn't even know that guy was there. All right, guys, so what we're gonna do is we have him being distracted. We've got Cooper back over this way, and we're gonna take that guy out. And hopefully with having taken this guy out, that'll allow her to then take him out. 
And uh, I still don't know how we're gonna deal with the three amigos over here, though. I guess he could take out the poncho guy while she distracts them. Suppose that would work. Of course, it's gonna be difficult to take this guy out. We gotta do Couldn't the timing you just right. The guy? Or does that not work? Uh, yeah, we could have tried that. I didn't even think to try it. Okay, can we get out of here before somebody sees us? Come on. Okay, so this is one guy taken out. Let's throw him down the cliff. Somebody's gonna find a cliff full of bodies. Mm -hmm. Ooh. All right, so now we have to distract these guys. Can he get up here? Is there any way up there? No. Okay, so we can't go that way. So that's unfortunate. That means we're gonna have to distract this guy again and bring Cooper back through here. Uh, but yeah, this is an incredibly challenging scenario here, guys. And yeah. and I think it's just gonna get like harder. Oh yeah, definitely. Uh, but yeah, I don't know, guys. Uh, you know, I don't really typically play games like this, uh, stealth games, period. Uh, I don't really like doing stuff over and over again, especially a game that's designed to do it over and over again. Mm -hmm. It's not really my style of game, honestly. And it also doesn't work well for a Let's Play. It yeah. does result in us like recording a ton of content uh, that we're not able to put up because we don't want you guys to sit no. through us trying to figure this out. I guess that's exactly what you're doing right now, <laughs> sitting, sitting through this as we try and figure it out. Uh, so, this guy can also see us, but he can't see yeah, us. He doesn't look as far. Okay, so basically we only need to worry about the three amigos here. And the guy running around. And the guy running around, of course. You're giving me ideas. <laughs> Whatever you say, Gordon. I don't know if we can get... Killed and punch you, man. No. All right, so that doesn't work. Maybe if we... I think you could kill the poncho man. Huh? Kill him? Yeah. While he's distracted. Oh, you're talking about the one right there that she's talking to? Yeah. Maybe. I, mean, I don't think anybody's looking at him. I guess you he just could do ran that. right by him and brushed shoulders with him and he didn't care. He's talking to a lady, Jinx. He's got a vagina on his mind. <laughs> Maybe. I don't know. Let's take a look and see if this guy can... No, this guy can see him. Oh wait, you know what? Yeah, Actually, he can't see him. Talk to him. <laughs> All right, so yeah, we There's might actually be able right to. There. So we we gotta wait for them to pass, though. Yeah. Yeah, there's just uh so much stuff to consider. All right, so we should be able to come up behind these guys. Oh. Yeah, he saw something. All right, let's kill this guy. Scratch <laughs> one. Alright, come on, come on, come on. <laughs> Get in the Come on. <laughs> Alright, so we've got rid of another quick guy. <laughs> Let's quick save that shit. Alright, so that'll allow her to distract somebody else then. I suppose we can distract this guy. Since I think there's no way for it to avoid him seeing us, honestly. So yeah, we'd have to distract this guy. So come up and distract him. And, you know, this is only, like, the fourth level or something. Yeah, it's, like, the fourth level. Maybe. So it just kind of shows you how challenging this is going to get, I think. What we need to do is mark that guy. <laughs> Alright, so that worked. We got our knife back. Nice. Quick save. Well, let's make sure we don't get caught here before we go quick saving it. And getting stuck in a situation. Sure. Oh. All right, so now we can go over here and hopefully take that guy out while those three are on the other side. Yeah, so we'll take him out and then we can go take Poncho Guy out. Although we might not even need to because we could probably just jump down. Oh, wow. Yeah, there's even like, more guys. All those damn dudes. Mm hmm. Yeah, I'll tell you what, guys, this is like. Really difficult uh, situation here. Oh, and they saw us. Like I thought I saw something. Mm hmm. All right, so let's go to mark this guy again. And then we'll run over to him. Kill him. I don't know how they didn't see that shit, but we won't complain. All right, get rid of his body. And then. 
Yeah, I guess we'll go to quick save real quick. <laughs> and then we're gonna go kill this guy. Just to get rid of him. And then we'll bring him into this bush here. Oh, I didn't know he'd be able to see us there. That's right, you have to be in a squad if you're a pirate. Mm -hmm. In order for them not to see you. So basically dragging his body. I don't know if there's going to be any way to avoid. You know, I'm actually surprised they could see us. They must have turned for like a split second. Yeah. Oh, okay, they stopped talking for a minute. This is nothing, darling. <laughs> Whatever you say. Drop it. <sighs> I tried. All right, let's try this again. This time we'll just knife him. Like, or just throw the knife at him, I should say. Mm-hmm. And that way, we can get this done. All right, now I don't know that we'll be able to get rid of his body, and I don't know if those guys can see us. Yeah, they might not be able to see his body at all, but if I remember, if anybody comes up here, then that would cause a problem. I don't think they will. Okay, so we need to distract him. So let's just get inside the bush here. And then switch on over to her. Alright, so he had a lot more pleasant uh, view. And with her leaving. I'm like, what the? <laughs> like an angel falling from heaven. Mm -hmm. So what we need to do is distract this guy once the other guy takes off running. Oh, that <laughs> just barely got through that. <laughs> Kill this guy. Just jump in the bush. Put him in the bush. Oh, he, okay, he disappeared. Go up the damn ladder. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> oh, good God. My uncle could use your help at the ranch. Sorry, Miss Sawyer. Not my line of work. I think maybe Cooper should take up her offer and go work on a ranch. <laughs> Not do this bullshit he no ain't more. so good at the killing and such. Careful. That's a guard dog up there. She's oh, the dogs will no know that way. she's. She hates me. Well, what do you who do she to is. the dogs? The dogs he... can sniff out characters even when they're hidden in bushes or behind cover. Once they detect a character, they will attack and start barking, which attracts other guards. Dogs also detect Kate even if she's wearing a disguise. Well, you should have been nicer to the dog. Probably should have been. What's the in dog there? Dog just wanted to play oh, fetch just or something. She probably like shoo shoo. How far can the dog detect? Is it just in his little yeah, range so. there? Okay. Looks like he's walking in a circle. Mm-hmm. All right, so we need to get through that gate. And so really, it looks like it's it's mainly the guard dog that's going to cause us problems. Mm-hmm. Although these guys can also see into the gate. The poncho guy can. But you can kind of uh, squat around oh, him, I think. those are long coats. Which guy is? The guy's down at the gate. Oh, yep, you're right. How do you get past them? Oh, yeah, that's right. You can go right down this way. She can't. She can't go that way? She can't climb. Oh, she won't be able to climb it. Okay, so yeah, the problem is trying to get past these two, huh? Mm-hmm. Hmm. Yeah, that's gonna be... All kinds of issues. Yeah, that's gonna be tricky. Yeah, the question of how, how to get her out of here. Wow, there's a lot of people over here, isn't there? Yeah. All right. Uh, so yeah, you just getting to get to the point, right? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I think so. But the question is, yeah, how to get past these these long coats? I'm not entirely sure well, how you're supposed to do that. Yeah, I don't know either. Without just straight up shooting them. Well, hmm. I guess if Cooper was able to get outside of the gate by climbing, going around and climbing up that mm -hmm. bush, that he might be able to use a coin on the That's far so side weird. of the long coats to distract him while she snuck through the gate. Can she sneak by them? Sure. <laughs> <laughs> I guess if she snuck right there, but where would she be while she was sneaking, true. where she couldn't be seen? Yeah, true. I guess these guys can't see Yeah, they see wouldn't her. care about her being there. Okay, so this is what we'll do then. Let's go ahead and switch over to her. Have her go behind the long coats. And just chill out right here. In preparation... Yeah. To uh, go out the gate as soon as he distracts him. Oh, that guy wasn't there before. Mr. Red Pants. Mm-hmm. Gotta watch out for him. He'll seduce you. Yep. Like, how you like my red pants? 
And you won't be able to control yourself. You know how expensive red dye is. Although I've always found a man in red pants to be. Yeah, like he ain't interested <laughs> in my <ladies>. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, it's not that. It's just very, like, I wouldn't say it's necessarily that you're gay. I mean, I think it's just kind of very dandy-ish, you know? Yeah. Like, maybe you're not interested in ladies. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so what we need to do is throw the coin, distract these guys here. Oops. Oh, uh -oh. oh well, they're going to oh, turn no. and look at her. <laughs> Damn. We didn't even think about that fact. No. That okay. they'd have to turn and look. Why would he turn that way? Out of all the ways he could turn. Could you throw it behind the one who saw her? Mm hmm Will they turn like, you know? We can try. Is he going to turn the weird way every time? I don't know. <laughs> well, we wouldn't be able to throw it there without everybody seeing us. True. So we have to be on this side. Let me see if we if we threw it a little bit different. You know what I mean? Maybe we yeah. can do this. You know, the way I threw it. <laughs> Isn't necessarily the only way we, no, can, we have to do that. No, the way he turned was dumb. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we're going to go ahead and save it here. That guy's going to oh, see us. He is. All right, so we'll go through here. And then let's try... Uh, we'll quick save here. And then what we're going to do is we're going to try and get them to turn around. This way? This way. I don't think that other guy's in there, though. You hear that? Okay. All right, so that ended up working. No. <laughs> oh, so close, uh, but didn't get through there. She gotta go like hide behind the pony or some shit. Well, then she'll be stuck on that side. I want to say. We can look to see what they can see here. Um, it does seem like they can see pretty fucking far. Can you go up behind this? I mean, we can try to come yeah, up behind it or whatever. Try. We'll see if that works, guys. All right, so let's go ahead and throw. We don't want to throw a knife. <laughs> or do we? Or do we? All right, so let's try this. Distract them. But maybe if we went this way? Oh, yeah, and jump in the bush. Yeah. You drive a hard bargain, Miss O'Hara. I simply know how to play my cards. And so they shouldn't be able to see us. We should be able to get all the way <laughs> over there. Toe. Yeah. Nothing Come to on. see here, just a <laughs> snaky woman. All right, so we are now in the zone. And now we just got to get him in, which should be f a lot easier. Since we can go Maybe. up through the... Well, yeah. we can go up through this backside here. Quick save? Uh, no, we'll go and do that now. I guess it'd be kind of tricky to get through this guy, though, won't it? True. Yeah, you got this guy. What if we just run down there? <laughs> I don't think that would work, Jinx. It'd be fine. I don't think so. Game over, man. We I think we, we can throw the coin. That's what we'll do. Of course, that won't distract the other guy. What if we threw it like, like that? That noise. And then that guy's gonna look that way. Hey, <laughs> <laughs> Nothing to see here. Alright, so that didn't work. I'm just trying to figure out a way that you can only alert this, that you only alert this guy. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not sure how to go about doing that then. Uh, maybe if we threw it. No, because it's got it's, that is at the very edge. Can you hmm. just knife the guy right. sitting down? Uh, I don't know. We can see if anybody's looking at him. Let's see if anybody's looking at him. Well, it would be too loud if we chucked the knife, James. But we might be able to just, like, yeah. walk up and stab him. Yeah, just stab him. I guess we'll see. It's fine. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't look like anybody gives a shit. Nobody cares about him. He was lazy. Mm-hmm. Oh, lazy bastard. And then knife that other guy. Yeah, and then we can just knife this guy. Just knife everybody. <laughs> yeah. There we go. All right. So I think with that... We should be good now. We should just be able to sneak around here. Oh, nope, nope. We forgot about that guy. <laughs> we we were able to get through there with her because, you know, she's yeah. in that, the, the outfit. She's just a woman. Mm-hmm. All right, so we got to do this over again, guys. I didn't quick save it. We'll quick save it this time. All right, so get rid of both of these guys again. And so now the question is... How to get through these ones. I suppose a coin would do the trick. Yeah, it might. 
Okay, so that's what we'll do. Let's chuck a coin over there. And make them look over that way. What's that noise? What's that noise? Oh, I think we got there. Oh, thank God. <laughs> I, hey, so, sorry. I, I'm awake. I, I'm awake. So you must be Mr. Cooper's friend. Ah, uh, yeah. And you are. Kate O'Hara. Pleasure to meet you. Yeah. Hey, Hector. So, uh, how was the wedding? Stop trying to impress a lady. We're heading out. Listen, I got someone that could... All right, guys, so what we're going to do, I know this is, like, right in the middle of a cutscene, uh, but this is, like, way too long. Like, this video, we've already gone, like, this is, like, episode one time frame now. We've gone a pretty long time because uh, we did want to get through that section, and I also didn't know how long the video had been either. Uh... Typically, Jinx notifies me, but I guess we were too into it trying to get through this section, uh, which has taken us an incredibly long time. This has been a long mission, uh, and that's not even counting all the uh, redos. Uh, you can see that it's an hour and 14 minutes, uh, so a very, very long time that we spent on this. Uh, but yeah, I don't know how long this cutscene is going to be, uh, so what we're going to do is we're just going to go ahead and uh, start up with the next episode here, just because this video is already getting kind of long, and uh, I'm trying to put this out tonight, actually, the night that we're recording it, so it's going to take a while to get this all edited and uploaded so cutting down the time would be helpful uh, so yeah we're gonna go ahead and cut it here uh, we will come back with the cutscene for the next episode uh, i do hope you guys enjoyed this one if you did make sure you leave a like uh, subscribe to our channel hit that notification bell and leave a comment i do hope to see you on the next episode and thanks for watching